Hi, I'm Hilary Talbot, acupuncture physician and clinical herbalist. Today we will be discussing acupressure points to increase lactation. There's actually four channels that are involved in lactation, but the one that I usually find the most success with um, is the small intestine channel. So I'm going to show you kind of a couple points on this channel to stimulate. The first point that I would always use is a fingernail point here um, on the, the small intestine channel, which um, the channel runs where the, the red and the white skin meet here down the side of the hand and through the wrist. Um, this point is easily found by locating the lowest part of the nail bed and the widest part of the nail bed and it's on the lateral side of the pinky and it's where the two would cross and this point can actually be um, easily stimulated with a fingernail or these little forceps that I have here. I'm actually going to put a little um, acupressure seed on it, a vicarious seed with a band-aid on it so that there's a little bit of continuous stimulation here. Now, you know, the milk actually takes a couple hours after the, uh, or a couple days after the cholesterol starts to flow. So it, you know, it's not immediate like some of us would like to think that it is. But the sooner that you get to these points and, and start the milk flowing, the better off you'll be as far as um, increased instances of mastitis, which is where the, um, the nipple actually clogs and that can be extremely painful. And then I'm just gonna rub the channel to try and open this up. And what this does is it helps to um, open up the waterways of the nipple. And so if you were having, let's say, um, one side was sufficiently lactating and the other side wasn't, you would want to use the channel and the hand on the side of the breast that you are experiencing problems with. Um, if it's both, then um, obviously stimulate both channels. As I said before, there are actually three other channels that can be helpful, but I find that this one clinically tends to work the best. Um, in addition to acupressure or acupuncture, um, we can also use herbal formulas that are safe for mom and baby, um, especially if it's an issue of deficiency where maybe the, the labor was so taxing and you lost so much blood and energy that your body is just simply not making enough milk. That can easily be alleviated in a, in a couple days with a, a Chinese herbal prescription for you. I encourage you to seek out an acupuncture physician that's skilled in treating issues during maternity and labor. I'm Hilary Talbot, and that was acupressure for increasing lactation.